Hey everyone, welcome to 2 Minutes Tuesday with Bala. This week we are going to look into Azure by sub variables. Let's get started. So what are variables? Variables are predefined values that can be reused across uh, your by sub template. Uh, the main reason of using variables is to reduce uh, and reuse. Um, so the number of variables, like once you define a location or a storage skew, you can use it across the board wherever you need. And then variables also support different data types in this case, like string numbers, arrays, um, something like a complex expression, you can even have a for loop as defined as a variable. So let's look into a, a simple example. Uh, variables in this case, um, I'm using parameters as well as variables. Uh, so variables, you can see there is a string variable, a concat variable. Main differences in, uh, uh, in a parameter, you're just coming with a regular uh, fixed value and in a variable, you're going to have like a dynamic value. So in this case, uh, you can see I'm defining a string var and then eventually using that to a concat or a concat to var or a concat to param. So you can have like a fixed values in parameters in variables. You can have dynamic values, then eventually use that in your templates. So actual use case here, um, let's take our storage example. Um, so in this case, I'm defining a, a variable a storage name and, in, uh, and I'm doing a string manipulation to lowercase and then and I'm also using a unique string function uh, which is going to take the resource group ID and then give me a unique hash. So all the time the storage names are unique and not being repeated. It's a simple use case. Object as variables, in this case uh, I'm having a test and prod uh, and the parameter environment name and then we are having environment settings where I'm providing for test I want to use a standard LRS and uh, for production I want to use a premium LRS. So whenever you want to use it in environment settings uh, directly you can pass the environment name. So that's all for this week. Thank you for watching. Uh, see you again next week with another topic. Thank you.